Hi, this is Cynthia from Main Street Financial Planning here with a money tip for you. This is a reminder to check your accounts to see whether you have reinvested your dividends. And in some cases, and with mutual funds, you might want to reinvest your capital gains. Now, there may be some instances where you don't want to have them reinvested. For example, if you're using that dividend income to supplement your living expenses, and then you're transferring it over to, say, a checking account. In other cases, when you're not using that, that type of income to supplement your living expenses, then you might want to reinvest. So take a look at your accounts to see whether you are reinvesting or not, and determine if that meets with your uh, with your goals for the account and for the income that's in there. If you reinvest both dividends and capital gains, capital gains reinvestment is only for mutual funds, then it will uh, add to the uh, number of shares, it will increase the number of shares, and you'll remain fully invested versus having a chunk of cash that you might need to uh, reinvest later. If you have a Vanguard account, you'll be able to find that under uh, my accounts, dividends and capital gains. And then in the upper right hand corner, you'll see change distribution elections. And so you'll see what your elections actually are. If you have a Schwab account, you'll go to positions. And then within all the positions over on the right hand side, you'll see a column that says reinvest with a question mark. And so that'll tell you either yes or no, whether those dividends are reinvested. So I hope you take a look at your portfolios, at least be aware of what's going on. And if you ever need some help, give us a call. Take care.